Hello everyone, welcome to another video from Somos Biology and in this video I'm going to answer one of your query that is CSI net eligibility criteria CSI net life science eligibility or any other CSI net a subject eligibility criteria you can watch this video csi net eligibility people have different doubts you know male female they have different eligibility criteria their age limits and all so what is csi net age limit and all so first things first csi net eligibility criteria is straightforward it stated that anyone from the science background because we are talking about science subjects examination so background of chemical science earth science uh, physical science mathematical science life science any of this and this individual must have qualified their graduation uh, and must have qualified masters or masters equivalent see masters and masters equivalent with minimum of 55 percent minimum of 55 percent masters or masters equivalent so master means normal msc master of science for all the courses okay master of science in physics chemistry mathematics uh, and life science and uh, different subjects like microbiology, biotechnology, biochemistry, molecular biology, all the different streams of uh, micro, uh, biotechnology and life sciences. All these things, they belong to both MSc equivalent. Either it will be MSc or it will be B.Tech, which will be con considered as MSc equivalent. Uh, if you are MBBS, it will be considered as MSc equivalent. If it's B.Pharma, considered as MSc equivalent. So remember, MSc or MSc equivalent degree and you need to score 55% in that to be eligible to do that as a general category remember whatever thing we are discussing we are talking about as a general category because for the SCST OBC EWS category the marks and cutoffs are always lower so if we talk about general category you know that that is the maximum limit that you need to achieve 55 percent marks second thing that is about eligibility is the age criteria see the second thing we are going to talk about is CSR net age limit age limit is something related to male and female see the age limit for a general category male is 28 years for jrf for ls it's lifetime so if you are applying for lectureship only then you can appear it for lifetime there is no age limit but for a jrf junior research fellowship it is of 28 years for male and for female the age limit for jrf in general category is 25 years plus 5 years relaxation so total of 33 years general woman general woman 33 years general men 28 years and for scst they are also of 33 years age limit and one more thing that i found many students these days have the doubt like sir we are from biotechnology so we need to appear csinet in biotechnology csinet in microbiology csinet is zoology botany see csir net is being conducted in one subject at a time so csinet life science that's it if you are from any different interdisciplinary science of life science then you are appearing for CSN and life science only. Be it biotechnology, microbiology, biochemistry, molecular biology, zoology, botany, physiology, whatever subject, whatever subject you choose, whatever subject you are from, you are going to attend CSN and life science. The same thing for the other disciplines as well. CSN and physical science is under any of the physics or any of the applied physics field, be it applied field, theoretical physics, uh, be it practical and application based physics any field they are applying for physical science in CSINET so CSINET life science covers every single interdisciplines that is under life science so if you are from zoology there is no separate exam called CSINET zoology there is only one exam CSINET life science okay so keep this in your mind and that is the eligibility of CSINET life science examination if you like this video please hit the like button share this video with your friends and colleagues and subscribe to this channel to get more videos like that in future and if you are preparing for CSINET if you are wondering where you can get extra guidance for your preparation you can join somos biology csi net preparation course csi net online course and that is available in our website the details are up there in the description you can call us the details are also there in the video thank you bye